when you really want it and like you just can't afford it because you're a broke bitch. Uh, just welcome to my life, okay? Welcome to my struggle. So, <laughs> welcome to my life. Welcome to my struggle. Welcome to this video. This is where this video came about. Again, this is not about me trying to steal Rihanna Shine or throw any shade at Rihanna or nothing like that because once I get the money, I'm damn sure going to support her. But until then, my Broke Life Chronicles is going to be about trying to slay on a budget. So, that's what this is about. So, if you're interested, interested, interested on trying to slay like Rihanna but on a budget this is for you Welcome to my channel. Don't mind me looking crazy like a strobing alien right now. I did a live swatch of my dupe of the Rihanna Trophy Wife. And tell me what you guys think. Is it dead on or an all? <laughs> but I know I look a mess. Don't mind that. Get past me looking a hot mess. Um, I'm <laughs> to you in somewhat of a raw face besides the DIY highlighter and my Carmax lip gloss. Other than that, there's no products on my face at all. But if you're interested in how I made this highlighter so that you can like slay like Rihanna and be a trophy wife, then continue watching. What you'll be needing for this video is a pan. You can use an empty pan like this, an uh, eyeshadow pan of your choice, rubbing alcohol. 70% or higher, so I'm using 91% rubbing alcohol. You can get this at Walmart, Walgreens, whatever. Just off the dollar store because they don't sell anything higher than 50. You'll be needing a gold shimmer, so any gold shimmer that you have. So this is by a company called Buxom, and this is their gold shade. I forgot what it's called, but I already had it. There's like some gold shimmers in here. I have a gold shimmer here. I have a gold like here. So you don't need to go out and buy anything. If you have gold eyeshadow, just use that, or you can go to Dollar Tree shimmers here and this is LA color girls and gets for just a dollar so we're going to try to redo trophy rife because honey no one has the coins at this moment to spend $30 and if you can make the same thing for like two dollars or less then why not just make it yourself and be your own Fenty okay so let's do this thing I do is take your pigment and empty it into the pan you want to use a lot of pigment because when you put the alcohol in this it doesn't matter how much powder you use it's really going to like boil down into nothing so i'm starting off with my la shimmers this is in 402 i don't think this color has a name but it is the only gold shade that they offer so if you're looking for the shade just look for the gold shade and this has like this weird applicator part that you have to stick a brush into so the way to get it out is just to beat it so I'm just gonna get as much product out as I can and so for the eyeshadow all I'm gonna do is use the tip of the spoon and just peel or scrape will be the more logical word so I'm just gonna scrape some of this deep gold pigment off and I'm just showing you it on the brush and then I'm gonna do a swatch and show you what it looks like this is the swatch of it on my hand sorry for the lighting being so awkward it's pitch dark outside and I'm using a fluorescent light bulb so I'm trying to capture this light as much as I can but that is what the shade is looking like I'm just gonna go on with the shimmery shade that I have it's like a gold sparkle shimmer and I'm editing that just because on the swatches that I've seen the reviewers did say that Trophy Wife did have a sort of sparkle to it and since Trophy Wife is all gold, I just thought why not be more extra and add a little gold sparks to it. This is what the gold sparky color looks like by itself, just the powder, no primer or anything on it. It does have a shimmer to it, so hopefully it can make our highlight pop. That is what the Dollar Tree powder is looking like by itself and tell me all three of these are not going to make a bomb trophy wife honey and you can do this for less than a dollar like come on now come on let's get it popping so let's mix our mixture on up and that's what it's looking like all three colors put together all right so i'm just going to be using a syringe to 
put the alcohol in. I really didn't measure my alcohol ratio. Alright, so the first time I added like a, one and a half milliliters. Now I'm, now I'm adding not even two milliliters, like half of two milliliters of a syringe. And then I'm going to start mixing this concoction up. And like I was saying, when the liquid hits the product, you do end up having way less product than what you think, honestly. So you do, if you want to fill up your whole pan and have like a big batch, you are going to have to continuously add more and more and more. But so far, this is what this is looking like. And tell me this ain't popping me no. So let's do a quick swatch, even though my lighting is freaking terrible. Like, look at, look at that. Tell me that's not giving you trophy wife vibes. Like, come on now. Tell me that's not giving you trophy wife vibes. Like, honey, and we did this for less than a dollar. Well, I did it for free because I already had the products in my hand. But look at that product and then on my skin. In the bottle, on the skin. I mean, in the tube, whatever the heck you call that right now. On this skin, look, I'm too hype. I can't even talk straight. Like, yes, honey. Tell me you're not going to walk around looking like somebody's trophy wife. But have you spent trophy wife money? Trophy wife money, honey? Yes, yes, yes. And this is for the broke girls. Like, honey, you broke girls. Who can't afford to spend $34? Who can't afford to go to Sephora and ball out? Because we broke and got bills to pay. Student loans to pay. We got books to buy honey let me tell you it's nothing wrong with having to make your own sorry that my tapping is probably distracting what i am saying and i say sorry and go back to tapping like a dummy what i'm saying is sorry sorry that my tapping is distracting what i'm telling you and this video is not me saying that i'm not in support of rihanna because honey if i had the money best believe Riri would be getting my money okay Riri would be slaying my life right now if i had the money but honestly i don't so since i want to look like a trophy wife without the trophy wife money then i got to do what i got to do okay so this is for all the girls out there across the world who want the look but can't afford it so honey don't get shook <laughs> i tried to do something there i don't know what the heck i was trying to say but what i'm saying is don't feel bad if you can't afford it. It doesn't mean that you can't go out looking nice. It doesn't mean that you can't go slay on a hoe as if you have the authentic 100. You have a dupe made by you. Because who did it? You did it. On the vibes. I think Rihanna would be so proud of me right now. She'd probably be mad because I can't support her at this very moment. I mean, but she got money, she'll be alright. I don't have money, so I won't be alright. I have to do what I have to do to survive. <laughs> For real, honey. If anybody knows the struggle, give this a thumbs up. Struggle is real. So I'm going to mix the little bit of alcohol I did put back in here into the product. I am going to add more alcohol to this just because it is a little clumpy right now and I don't like the way it is looking together highlight so all you're gonna do is just tap it against your flat surface just to get it nice and soft well not soft <laughs> dummy you get it nice and flat you do want it to be flat you really don't want any lumps and bumps in your highlighter at this time you'll be taking any type of towel like a paper towel I am using a dried um, what do you call that wipe and I'm just going to press it into the powder just to get any of the excess alcohol off I'm not gonna lie you might get some product transference it has happened to me before like this product transference but look at that that's something we made together we did this we made ourselves a trophy wife spit in gold honey so yes this is what the highlighter is looking like after blotting the most of the alcohol out. So I'm gonna let this sit. But I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like. It isn't fully dry, but I'm impatient, I'm sorry. So we're gonna have to like swatch it like now. So that is what it is looking like. Let me get it out the light, it's blinding. Like the, all I did was press the product 
twice onto my finger and that is what it is looking like and I'm gonna swatch it on my hand let me see can I try to do it just to swatch it on my thigh just because that's the only way I can do a live swatch so this is what the product is looking like it's kind of chalky because it's not all the way dried but look at that and as you see my thigh was hella bare before this and now it's shining bright like a diamond let's build it just a little more just because we can look at that yes yeah the product i showed you guys that we made it and again i do not have it this is the one that we diy'd and made so it is on the brush yeah honey honey i'm shining bright like a motherfucking diamond like let me switch angles see can you see that like i'm sure i'm shining on them I'm shining on them. All right, so let's do the side that has the fake primer on it. All right, so product on the brush. Ooh. Fake. Ooh. Do do y'all do y'all see do y'all see that? Am I blinding you yet? Are you blind yet? Did you grab your shades for this? Like, <laughs> yes. Like, honey. Honey, Tommy, Tommy doesn't like we went and bought the product itself. And crazy for this side to be the side that has the fake primer on it. Um, this side is popping a lot. Y'all, y'all better get to prepping tomorrow. I know the quality of this video isn't the best because, like I said, it is nighttime. Just to show you guys real quick. Ooh, it is nighttime. There is no light coming from outside. I'm just using this little fluorescent light of mine. So that's all that's giving me the brightness that I have at this very moment. But I had to get this video out because I know everybody is like going frantic over the Rihanna beauty line. And I'm not going to lie. Once I do get the money, I am going to get her foundation because I heard it was popping. And I want to try it for myself because I went to MAC and got matched by somebody. And she gave me the darkest shade ever and there's nothing wrong with dark skin tone it's just that I am not dark skin I don't have deep brown skin and she gave me deep brown skin tone so I would love to see if Rihanna's um product could really match my face but I gotta take this off again sorry for this poor quality of video sorry for it being so bootleg but I had to get this video out there for everybody who was just going frantic and crazy over trophy wife because we know not all of us can afford the fabulicity of that product and hell sometimes we gotta make it ourselves so go ahead and make it yourself so you can be shining bright like Rihanna <laughs> But thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to hit that like button and that subscribe button. And then comment down below, honey, if you're going to make your own. If you think this is a dead on dupe or close enough. Also, if you would like to see more of these type of videos for those of us who are balling on a strict budget. Budget is real. So if you enjoy these type of videos, let me know. Again, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, guys, bye.